Today we are buying and trying rare textures and types of slimes and testing some cool things that maybe you didn't know you could do with slime. You guys seem to really like the last slime video that I did and I had a lot of fun with it, so we're doing it again. Starting off with this TikTok that I found that has 10 million views. It's by a shop called OG Slimes and they're just rating some of their best selling slimes. They just have so many with really cool textures and details that I've never seen before. Like this one looks like liquid metal. It's so cool. And then this one, Crystal Coma, the texture just looks like it feels so satisfying. And it has like this iridescent glow to it. They just have all these different slimes and they put the cutest little things in it, like these cactuses. Honey slime, we tried that last time. I was only able to buy one of the slimes in this TikTok because they sell out so fast. That's what makes these slimes so rare. But the OG slime website had some really cool new ones that just launched and I'm excited to try them and show them to you. Okay, here they are. We got three different kinds. So the first one, this is one that was in the TikTok. This is called Eucalyptus Fluff. I'm kind of hoping that it's like the towel slime from last time. That was my favorite slime ever. It was like soft and fluffy. Oh, it smells amazing. Oh, wow. Okay, it is like the towel slime, but slimier for sure. The towel slime almost had like a dry cottony feel to it. Oh my goodness, but it's so soft. I think I have yet to find a slime that beats the fluffy slimes for me. There's nothing obviously in this one, but I could literally sit here for hours and play with it. It really does have like a minty eucalyptus smell to it. Okay, first slime is a win. <laughs> the next OG slime, this one is called Moon Rock. I don't know what type of like base slime it is, but there's literally rocks in it. It just feels kind of like your typical slime. It smells incredible. It smells like white chocolate. Do not eat. <laughs> It's funny, but it literally smells like you could eat it. I can feel the rocks. Oh, wow. It smells good, huh? Oh my gosh, I love it. <laughs> oh, it's so poppy. Okay, texture wise, this is a good one. I feel like last time we got a bunch of slimes that had like beads in it and they just were not doing it for me. They were like flying out of the slime, but oh, this is so good. Good quality slimes just right out of the jars. So I'm very impressed. Okay, moon rocks. I give this one like a nine out of 10. Our next one is space themed as well though. Space junk. So it's a clear slime with so much stuff in it. This is so cool. It's like a bunch of different beads and glitters. Okay, we've got beads. These little berries are fun. <laughs> Glitter, some little moons and stars. This is a fun one. Look at it. Ah! Okay, why are the beads staying in this slime? Last time the beads would not stay in the slime. Oh no. It's so sticky. Honestly, all of the slimes from this place are an A plus. I feel like these were a huge win. I get why they sell out so fast. Okay, this one's getting a little sticky though. I definitely need like an activator or something. Oh, they sent some? Can you open it for me? <laughs> I can't remember if the powdery activator makes it less sticky or more sticky though. Is that all they sent? Just a little bit. Yes, that's definitely helping. I don't know if it's supposed to go from like clear to cloudy like that though, or if I just played with it too hard. I mean, it still looks cool. I'm gonna be saving all of these slimes because our last product in this video is going to require all of them. <laughs> I think it's gonna be cool. Okay, I have never seen anything like this next one. I don't know if you can do this with every slime or if this is like a special slime, but you can literally blow bubbles in it. Okay, on my main channel, I got a water slime and they sent this like big straw thing. And I was trying to blow bubbles with it. And now I'm wondering if I subconsciously remember this video and that's why my mind went there. With <laughs> this slime, you're actually supposed to be able to do this. So I got some. Oh my gosh, they sent me a free gift. I feel like slime shops are so nice. They always throw in free stuff. Okay, here's our watermelon slime. Look how cute this one is with the little watermelons in it. And then I'm assuming you can just use any straw. Oh my gosh, it smells like watermelon candy. Oh my gosh, cute. And there's even little seeds in it. What? There's like chunks in it that look like watermelon slices. <gasps> this one's so cool. I love these slices. Can we blow a bubble in it? Okay, so in the TikTok, they just kind of like got a blob of it and then take a straw. Whoa! Okay, it definitely works. <laughs> it does. The whole room smells like watermelon now. Why is this so fun? I could literally sit here for hours and do this. 
Oh my gosh! That's the best one! Well, if you're ever bored of your slime and you need something new to do with it. Yeet! <gasps> I'm getting lightheaded. I wanna get one more good one. I'm way too easily entertained. So far, everything's been a win. Okay, this next one isn't so much about the slime itself as much as the product you put the slime in. I don't know why. I just think this is so cute and funny. Here he is! <laughs> I'm so excited. Creativity booster, calming device, sensory item. Oh, it comes with slime. Okay. It's definitely more of a like a jiggly water slime. So I did get out my water slime and honey slime. I didn't realize he'd come with some. Look at him. Oh, it even comes with a storage bag. Oh, this one feels nice. It's definitely like a water slime. Oh, it's all in his mouth. <laughs> That was really gross, actually. Okay, he's low-key kind of gross, but I still love it. <laughs> okay, are you ready for the next one? It's peanut butter slime, and it literally looks like peanut butter. The color, the texture. I wonder if it smells like peanut butter. Okay, I got some to try. Look at the smarties. See, I'm telling you, slime people are the nicest. Did they send me a free slime? What? That's so nice. They sent me Andrea's Slime Boutique, Mickey Milk. Oh my gosh, cute. Oh, it smells good. It's like a light blue and there's colorful Mickey confettis. And then on the bottom, oh my goodness. They're like little marshmallows, little foam. That was so nice. Okay, but our peanut butter slime. Look at it. It literally looks like you could scoop it up and eat it. Oh my goodness. And it does smell like peanut butter. No way. Ooh, is it gonna be a, a fluffy slime? Peanut butter. It's like a soft slime. <gasps> this is everything I hoped it would be. I thought I liked towel slime, but when they add a scent into it, it really just puts it over the top. Look at this. Oh, doesn't it just make you want to eat it? It actually smells like a peanut butter cookie or something. It's very sweet. Literally, we have not had one bad slime yet. This is awesome. Okay, our next slime is kind of a slime. I think we can classify it as a slime. It's called a nice cube. And it's almost like a solid slime that doesn't come apart or leave residue. It just looks so interesting. So if you want something that's not messy, this could be a good option. Okay, let's try it out. The packaging is so cute. The new squishy, squeezy, square sensation. A super solid squish. And we got not a blue one, but of course, a pink one. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, look at it. It matches my couch. Like, exactly. That's funny. This is like a stress ball. The new version of a stress ball. You're like at school or at work. Just. I wonder if you could break this even if you tried. Why do I just want to pull it apart? It's not supposed to be pulled apart, but I want to. This is so funny. I'm honestly so confused how it's made. It is that satisfying squish of slime, but it's not messy. This is great. I feel like it could be a stress ball for the parents and then like a mess free slime for the kids. It's a win for everybody. In case you guys were wondering what's inside the nice cube, Anna broke it. <laughs> Where's the hole? I don't want to yeah. get it on me. <gasps> Give me your hand. Ew. Ew, what is it? Ah, it's like glue. Okay, maybe the nice cube isn't as clean as we thought it was because if that gets out. Oh no! Okay, so it's this little machine and you can take your slimes that you're like bored of, you don't use anymore. You put this little like balloon thing in the machine, you blow it up and you can either like make your own slime like she's doing here with the powder and the liquid and the different add-ins. Or you could just put in slime that you already own and you basically have something similar to the nice cube that we just tried, but made out of whatever slime you want to use or create. I think this is so cool. Of course we gotta try it. I feel like we we gotta try making our own squishy, but then after that we should make a Franken squishy with all of the slimes that we got here. It is, oh my goodness, mine's a glittery, literally. <laughs> Mine's a glittery yellow one. Oh, this is gonna be fun. All these glitter and confettis. Okay, now we pump our squishy into the support. Next, one scoop of squishy powder. Go. Okay, now we can add in whatever else we want. I want to do, Ooh, these cute blue and pink sparkles. Well, what's gonna happen if I put confettis in? Won't those just like dissolve once I add the water? Let's try it. Okay, now we fill it with water. Now we put this stopper thing on. Pull the squishy over that. <laughs> how do I get my squishy out? What? How did she just pull it off like that? 
I'm so confused. How'd you get it out? <laughs> mm, I got it, I got it. Okay, squishy. Now we twist and clip. <gasps> oh no! Oh no, can I salvage it? Okay, squishy clipped. Okay. <laughs> now we gently clean up this gel mess that I made. That should not have been that difficult. Safe to say I am a beginner. Clearly. Okay, there's our squishy. I wonder how durable it is. Like, it feels pretty durable. That plastic is pretty thick. Okay, that's fun. And it looks really pretty with the sparkles. We basically made our own nice cube. Okay, I don't know if that was just like rough because it was my first time or what. <laughs> Because you made it look so easy. I mean, the end result is pretty fun though. Okay, squishy round two. We're gonna put pieces of all of our slime in it and see what happens. <laughs> Honestly, this might be less messy than the gel. Wish me better luck this time. <laughs> Let's start with some space junk. I know how much of each to add. That looks about good. And we're gonna do some of the Mickey milk, moon rock, watermelon, and we'll finish it off with some eucalyptus. Let's tie off our squishy and see our creation. <gasps> That looks so cool. Oh my gosh. I can't wait to squish this all together. There we go. Oh my gosh, this is great. Okay. Look how cool that looks. I kind of don't want to squish it. All the colors are just so pretty. Oh, and you can totally feel the beads in the rock still. I mean, it's actually kind of hard to mix together. Okay, here it is mixed. It's actually kind of pretty, like a pastel tie-dye. You can sit here and play with it and kind of find the different beads in there. Thanks so much for watching. If you haven't checked out my first slime video, you should watch that. And we'll see you in the next video. Say bye, YouTube.